This is one of those LED spotlight chips. And if you watched my other video on it, uh, I mentioned that it started overheating and it needed a bigger heat sink and all that. And what I wanted is I didn't want a monster heat sink on this. I wanted it to be a small package. And as you can see, it's not very big. I mean, I cover it with the end of my finger. So I wanted a small package out of it. I didn't want a monster heat sink. I don't want to take a lot of space. And I want to be able to run it continuously. So what I came up with was putting it on the back of this, this fan. This is a processor cooling fan for a laptop. And it's got an aluminum back on it. So I bolted it to the back, used some heat sink compound. And I uh, was hoping that the heat would go through into the aluminum and then the fan would carry the heat away. Unfortunately, this fan is 5 volts, so I had to use a 5 volt regulator. My other choice was a uh, 12 volt fan, but as you can see, it's a lot bigger. A lot bigger. Okay, so how does it work? Well, let's see. We'll crank it up and this is about 6 volts. The fan is running. Lights on, 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 yes. Should be about 7 volts. They start to come on. Um, it's not really very bright yet. This is 8 volts. And as you can see, it's starting to get a little bit bright. You can start to see through my finger. Can't point this directly at the camera because it just freaks the camera out. So we can use my finger as an indicator of how bright it is. Okay, crank it up to 9 volts. You can see it getting brighter. There's a little bit over 9. You can see from my finger it's quite a bit brighter. But the bad news here is that this is as bright as it gets. Uh, anything more than this and it starts to overheat. So uh, this experiment was not 100% successful. I got my small package, but I can't, uh, I can't run it at 11 volts where it's supposed to be. So I'm still 2 volts shy of uh, being able to operate at 100%. But still it's a, you know, one step forward and I guess I'll have to uh, think about how I can do this and still keep it down as a small package. Okay, well that was it. Not 100% success, but uh, something moving forward. Hope you found it interesting.